We can simplify algebraic fractions, or any kind of fractions, as long as we do the same to the top and the bottom. So if we look at this first one over here, 2 over 4, what we can do is we can divide the top and bottom by 2. So if we divide the top by 2, we get 1, and we divide the bottom by 2, we get 2. So 2 over 4 is the same as 1 over 2. Now we can do exactly the same thing if there's x's or any kind of algebra involved. So in this example, we can divide the top and bottom by 2, as we did previously, which will give us, I'll go down here, to x over 2x, divide the top by 2 and the bottom by 2. But I can also divide the top by x and the bottom by x. And so if I divide the top and bottom by x, that will give me 1 over 2. So this is the same as a half as well. Here I've got x plus 1 and x plus 1. So I can divide the top and bottom by x plus 1. So that will cancel them out. So I'll get 2 over 4. And if I divide top and bottom by 2, I'll get 1 over 2. And finally here, I've got, I can divide top and bottom by x plus 2. Divide top and bottom by x plus 1. And half the top and the bottom again. So all of these fractions here are the same and they just mean half. Okay, so in this case, it doesn't look like we can divide the top and the bottom by the same thing. Uh, what you definitely don't do is you don't go they both got x squared, because that's not dividing by x squared, that's taking x squared off, and we can't do that. So what we've got to do here, the first step, is we've got to put them into brackets. So we've got to factorise the top and the bottom. So let's have a go at that. So we're going to do... What's in both of these? x, so we have x, x plus 4, and then double brackets on the bottom, x in both. What times is to give 8, and adds to give 6, plus 2, plus 4. Now we, we could have known, we could have guessed it was going to be a plus 4, because we needed that to cancel out. And we can divide top and bottom by x plus 4. And that leaves us with x over x plus 2. We can't simplify this anymore because we can't divide top and bottom by the same thing. So that's the final answer. Okay, same again here. We need, we need to factorise the top, factorise the bottom. So they're both double brackets. What time is to make 12 and adds to make 1? It would be plus 4 minus 3. And on the bottom... We know one of these two is going to be in it. What times to make four adds to make five? Four and one. And we cancel out the x plus fours. So the final answer is x minus three over x plus one. And finally here. Double bracket the top. And you should recognise this is the difference of two squares. It's a double bracket as well on the bottom. So the bottom is x plus 3, x minus 3. And the top, it's going to be 5 and 3. So x plus 3, x minus 5. Cancel the x plus 3s, leaving x minus 5 over x minus 3. If you're getting stuck on the factorising part, go back and watch a video on factorising. Um, so you need to be able to factorise to do the simplifying of the algebraic fractions. Okay, here's some more questions. Can you give these ones a go? Pause the video and I'll put the answer up after. Okay, first one. Factorise the top, which is x and x minus 3. We know it's going to be x minus 3 on the bottom, but it's um, 3 times 9, so it's plus 9 minus 3, which gets us to 6, and times to make the minus 27. Those ones cancel. x over x plus 9. Okay, double bracket the top, double bracket the bottom. Uh, 24, 6 times 4, so x plus 6, x minus 4, and 4 and 1, so x minus 1 
x minus 4. x plus 6 over x minus 1. And we've got the difference of two squares on the bottom. And plus 5 take 3. That's the final answer.